Hey, Hugh Sullivan here to show you a quick, cheap way to get a steady, low angle shot with your DSLR without spending big money on a hi-hat or an overexposed pro platform. I'd been looking at hi-hats for a while because until now I had been cradling the camera to get my low angle shots. It worked well, but recently I saw that Vincent LaFerre was recommending these pro platforms on his blog. As soon as I saw it, I realized that it was very similar to the sticky pod that I already had. I knew I didn't want to get any unnecessary wear and tear on the suction cups, so I made this instead. All you need is a one foot squared piece of half inch plywood and a knuckle to hold the camera. I already had the extension arm and the knuckle from the sticky pod, but you can get the knuckle itself for about $21.95 from stickypod.com. And I'm sure you can get something even cheaper on B&H if you look hard enough. All you need to do is make sure that the knuckle you get will accept a quarter inch screw on the bottom because that's what you use to attach it to the plywood. So just drill a hole in the middle of the plywood and attach it, and you're done. And once you've done that, you can achieve any range of angles without having to prop the camera up with items from your camera bag. You can get straight up in the air, pointing down at the feet, whatever you need. And it's also nice for getting the popular Tarantino trunk shot. So, there it is, for less than 30 bucks, especially if you already have some of this stuff laying around, you can get the same result as a $140 Pro platform or the up to $500 hi-hats. Check back soon to see how I built a decent stunt dummy for my Batman movie without spending a lot of time or money. I'll give you a hint. It's thrift store clothes and a lot of PVC. Thanks for watching.